I'm going to update my closet and put in the IKEA pack system, so stay tuned. Today I'm going to organize my closet. I ordered the Billy bookcase at um, Ikea and I'm actually going to put it in the closet here. So you know how they have the pack system from Ikea. I just find that it's a little bit expensive. It's a very small space. I don't really need all of the items that they need. So I bought separate items. It's coming in for delivery today. So I'm going to get my closet done. I rearranged my room and I took out my chest drawer and a lot of the items that were in there are now just stacked in the closet. It's not organized. Things are falling down and it's just not cute. So I'm deciding to just get the closet completely done and I'm gonna do that today. So stick around and watch me create this inexpensive closet. All items are coming from Ikea and I'm going to build. More. So I'm gonna show you what the closet looks like now. So they all need to go. I'm also gonna declutter to get rid of some of the stuff because some of them I haven't worn in a long time and it's just not needed or necessary so that the space will look organized so this is what the closet looks like now. A lot of the sweatpants, shorts, and all those things are just like stacked up in the closet. Then you have my bags. And then over here, I have a lot of the items just hung up, a lot of my sweaters. These are items that I don't really wear so much. So I'm just gonna get rid of some. And then my shoes, a lot of the shoes, they it just really need to be organized um they like stuffed in the closet originally i was gonna use the bookshelf to create my closet organizer or customized wardrobe but then i opt not to do that because when i had put the bookshelf inside the closet none of the shelves were fit in the drawers weren't fit in that i had purchased separately and the glass top for my jewelry case was not fitting in the bookshelf. So I just scrapped that idea and I went over to Ikea and I got the Ikea pack system. And it's a customizable wardrobe system that allows you to design and organize your storage space according to your needs. So I purchased four drawers and um, some shelves and some other items that would go well with the closet system. And it's so flexible and i didn't have to spend so much because it is a small closet that i'm working with so i only needed two pieces the pack wardrobes comes in predetermined frame sizes and you can combine those to fit your available space so i did just um, did my measurement to make sure that the one that i chose was gonna go closest wall to wall and then i customized my design by putting the exact things that i need so i mix and match different internal accessories like shoe rack full pull out basket dividers and led lighting i got all of those items from ikea it was time to prepare the closet to put the pack system in so i cleared the space i emptied the closet entirely removing all clothes, shelves, rods, and personal items. I didn't remove the closet door because I didn't want that to be difficult to put back on. So I was very careful putting in the pack system without the doors removing. I unscrewed the shelving unit and brackets attached to the wall. The shelves were screwed down with nails, so I gently pat with the hammer, a crowbar, so I used the hammer. And I was very careful because I didn't want any splinter to fly back on me. And I wasn't pulling too hard because it was drywall and drywall will break. And I don't wanna do any unnecessary patching.
touches to finish up the pack system so I had gotten the lighting system put some within the drawers so that when it's because it's a censored light so I'm gonna use these on the top shelf um, I also had gotten six packs of motion lights from Amazon and I'm gonna use that as well in the pack system I'm also gonna cover up this area here I'm going to cover it up with wallpaper because I still have a bit from when I had redesigned my room and I'm going to use it um, to cover up this wall. And this is the wallpaper that I'm going to use. It's the same design as my previous videos. I was thinking to paint the wall, but then I would have to patch this drywall. So instead, I'm just going to put the wallpaper all the way up here like this and just bring it to the bottom portion result of the pack system when I included the drawers and um, the cupboards as well as the hangers and the lighting system. Because it's a small closet I add the things that I need to make it very functional. Baskets on the top to put items in there that I don't normally use that maybe eventually I will use. So and then I add this lighting system here and it's supposed to be censored i think it's off so let me turn it on the handlebars a section for my handbag as well my jewelry i got this case here for my glasses and then my jewelry and i have these drawers here I added like these drawers, added my t-shirts and my shirts in them. And then the other side of the closet is here. I'm going to pull that drawer open. I'm going to pull the closet door open so you can see it. I also put wallpaper on the side so you can see it properly. side of the closet and you have the pants I got a pull-out shelf 
basket and I put like hats in there, things that are just a little bit more loose. So I put it in the pullout shelf and shoes. So I have the shoes here. space looks like near the closet area so I so I ordered this set here which is this shelf from Ikea and it came in today so I add it but I put it on the outside of the closet because the space inside is very limited and I have space over here so I just decided to put it on the outside I will lift it up and mount it to the wall but for now, I just add it right at the side. And these are the items that I had put on it. Probably going to change out that bag. And when you open the door, the shoes and the trays do pull out. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.